Hey, what's up, guys? Duck here, and today I'm going to be showing you all how I've been preparing for Perfect Armor with my island, what we've been exactly doing to get as many diamonds as possible, like how we have so many diamonds already. So we already have 10 enchanted blocks. All these backpacks are full of diamonds, if I guess we should maybe show you all. But uh, it's like we have all these backpacks full of enchanted diamonds, and we have even more as well that I can show you in a minute. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all how exactly we're getting all these diamonds and how exactly we're going to be preparing in the future for when Perfect Armor does come. So one of the main things we've been doing is just literally having all of our minions on diamonds. So we have 17 diamond minions here. I think we actually have an 18th slot. I think that's on something else though. So we have all but one of our minions on diamonds right now, which I think is pretty adequate for what we're trying to do. Obviously just having this going with enchanted charcoal or solar panels on it is very, very effective. And we've been having like, Basically, we've been doing level 5 to level 7 for all of them. Level 5 is really the most efficient, though, so I wouldn't go above level 5 unless you just really plan on having your diamond minions up for a really long time. Now, we've already gotten quite a lot of diamonds out of this. Like, we have a lot of diamond blocks saved up here. We had redstone here at one point, but we took those down. So now we just have diamonds going, but yeah, we've been getting a lot of diamonds from this. Like, literally, like, all those blocks of diamonds are going to get us a lot of diamond, like, a lot of enchanted diamonds. And also, as you can see, another thing we do is sometimes we mine it. So like QS9 is mining this. So it's also really good for XP. I made a video like using this for XP. But if you mine it with your like high mining level and obviously Fortune 3, you have a pretty good chance of getting like two to four. Well, basically like two to four diamonds every time you break uh, ore, which is obviously more efficient than the minions breaking it. And also you get XP and mining XP out of it. So eventually you'll get even more and more diamonds out of it, which is obviously pretty effective. Obviously, this isn't like the primary way we get diamonds, but it is a way that I've probably got a couple stacks of enchanted, uh, maybe 10 stacks or so, but obviously this is nothing compared to the total amount of diamonds we have. All right, guys, so we just got to deal with Frozen Eclipse for 32 enchanted quartz and a quartz 5 minion for a bunch of diamond blocks. You can find people that don't want diamond blocks, like they just have diamonds, but they don't necessarily want to keep them, so you can find stuff that they're, they need, so like they, like... For, for example, Frozen Eclipse wanted quartz, so I could go ahead and trade them quartz that we had extra of. I mean, we still have a little bit extra, but, you know, I'm giving them a decent chunk of our quartz, and I'm giving them a quartz 5 minion. I mean, we have a couple more quartz 5 minions, but the thing is, I might actually need those, so I can't just trade all of them. But, for example, like, this would be something that y'all could definitely do. We're getting 20 stacks of diamond blocks for the quartz 5 minion and 32 enchanted quartz. I mean, that's that's one way to definitely get a lot of diamond blocks very quickly. If y'all do have extra of other things, definitely really good. If y'all do want to get, like, some of these trades down, you can go in my Discord, which will be down in the description. And I'm sure if you ask in general, like, trying to get X, Y, or Z, I'm sure people will be willing to trade you. Uh, I don't necessarily know the pricing on all this, but yeah, they'll definitely be able to, they'll definitely be willing to trade with you. Another option for you guys is going to be getting a lot of money from things like pumpkin farming or melon farming or sugarcane farming, whatever. And like, like we have like 10.3 million right now. If we really wanted to, we go in this auction house, we can go to the uh, better, you're going to click on the blocks category and you can see there's like 13 enchanted emerald blocks. So we need diamond blocks. We're not paying that much for diamond blocks. They're not worth that much. Uh, I think a more reasonable price is going to be in the, yeah, somewhere around the, like, 175k, uh, for, like, each enchanted block, so you can go ahead and buy these, I'm not gonna buy them right now, because I think we're probably gonna have enough diamonds, but technically, we could probably buy, like, 50 enchanted diamond blocks on the auction if we really wanted to, I don't think we're going to unless, like, the day Perfect Armor gets released, we don't have enough. Then we might buy some on Auction House or trade for some, like, enchanted blocks from other people or something like that. But for now, we're, we're really not going to bother with that unless we, like, the day of just don't have enough diamonds. But if y'all are just starting to grind for it now, that may be something you have to do because we honestly think it's going to take 48 to 96 enchanted blocks to craft, which is obviously more than most people just have saved up. Also, Jai Varmint, an admin on the server, came into my stream one day, and I was asking them if it was going to take, like, diamonds or not. They kind of hinted at that it's going to take diamonds, but it's also probably going to take something else. So, my theory is that it's going to take something from the end release that we can't necessarily grind yet. Now, if that's the case and it's something we can't grind yet, obviously, we can't really do anything about it. So, for now, we can't really prepare in that aspect, so we're just really dealing with the diamonds for now. But once Perfect Armor actually comes out, then we can start grinding for whatever else we need for it. Like, I don't know if it's going to be the Inner Dragon boss soul to craft it or what else, but supposedly it's going to take something else. What else it takes, 
I have no idea. I mean, I could try grinding a little bit of everything, but I really, like, as I said, I have no idea. So it, it's really up on the table right now, but I'm assuming something from the end most likely would make the most sense, especially if it's coming out with the end. Now, there's no guarantee that happens. Like, it might not come out with the end. It might not come out for a month. So we don't really know when Perfect Armor is coming. We know it says coming soon, though, so it's probably not going to be an exorbitant amount of time, but it's also might not be this week is the point. Another option is technically to mine diamonds here at like the normal diamond place where you're going to be mining them in the very beginning. This isn't really like a bad idea, especially if you don't have enough diamonds to have a bunch of diamond minions going. The thing is, due to the pricing of perfect armor, most likely the point, like it's just going to take forever, at, like basically to get enough diamonds if you're just dealing with mining them right here. Now, obviously, like I have a 4x drop rate sometimes, which is really good. But still, it's going to take a long time just mining right here. As you can see, the, the diamond minions at the island are probably going to be quite a bit faster. Especially if you have like 17 like we do. But if you don't have very many diamond minions on your island, then I guess this could be a valid strategy. But I would honestly say farming and like buying diamonds might even be better than this strategy. Just because of like the timing. But it's up to you really. Obviously getting your mining up in the long run will help you out though because then whenever like new items come out in different categories then you'll already have a high mining level, have a high 4x drop rate and all that and you could be prepared for some of the newer stuff coming like iron collection, gold collection, lapis collection, all that and not have to worry about getting your mining up. But it's really up to you. You still obviously get a lot of mining levels from just having the diamond minions on your island in general. And what you can also do is put minion expanders on the diamond minions, and that would help as well. I might make a video on those at some point here, but I haven't done that yet. I don't exactly have the stuff to make a bunch of minion expanders right now, but if I did, then I could possibly do that. And for those of you with a keen eye, yes, I did come to the diamond reserve with $10.3 million on me. Don't do that, okay? Don't do that. Anyways, guys, I think that's going to be the end of this video. I hope it really helps you all get a bunch of diamonds to prepare for perfect armor. Obviously... We don't even know when it's coming for sure, but a lot of people predict it might be this week or the week after, you know, coming pretty soon because it is a coming soon item. And the admins did say they're trying to get through the coming soon items quickly, so it seems relatively likely that it's coming at least in the next month. Uh, a lot of people are predicting it for this week with the end update, which has been set back a couple days. We don't know exactly what's going to happen. I think there's a chance that it's Thursday or Friday. I don't think it's going to be today. Anyways, if the video helped you out, prepare for perfect armor. Consider liking helps me out a lot. Helps promote the video. Also, if you're new here, consider subscribing for more content. And before we go, let's make a quick shout out to all of my members. Shout out to all my tape fanatics in Valus, Complicated, Brax, Haha, Kyle Zhao, My World, Jaxter, 819, FTH underscore Ryan, Corrupt Kirby, Andrew Smith, ATR Vibes, The Last, L, WowJ, EverG501, Angel of Death, Dark Dwayne, Sod, LGB, It's Aura, Doxy X, and Greenlee UW. And lastly, a massive shout out to all my tape addicts in Smiley TV, Oh My God, It's Perry, 52 and 2, Atticus Scout, and Leon Rom. Thanks so much, guys. Y'all are all awesome. Anyways, I hope y'all did enjoy, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace, guys.